Well, I finally got fed up with looking at that completely out of scale pressure gauge on the Walesco mobile. So, there we go. Let's get you looking more like a proper locomobile instead of that out of scale thing. And it'll give me a good try out on the little MCO SL Unimat. As you can see, this is what we call the machine tool workshop. Uh, roses woodworking stuff for the doll's houses. And the lathe. setting it by hand there is no set cutting on this lathe but the old fashioned method works Next stage is the center drill. And then a two millimeter hole right the way through. <coughs> which is difficult to do one-handed, as was the machining on the lathe. I'll get a camera mount one day.
And there it is. The finished little adapter. Nice little job for the little lathe. See what it can do. And there's the new pressure gauge fitted. I think it looks a lot better than this huge big thing and certainly more into scale but that's just my opinion And of course, the final proof of the pudding, will she run okay? And of course she does. Nice and quiet as always. And no leaks. And yes, that looks a lot better. We get a view from all angles. Now the pressure gauge is registering. Um, I could have got it a dot of six. Not a four, what is that? A dot of six, but it's not that. And as you can see, nice and steamy. Quick wipe of the lens, and that's from a different angle. Even there, it's going to a better lick. And there she goes, nice and steady, nice and quiet. Yes, that is. Certainly an improvement on this pixel. Well, I think so anyway. Somebody once said, beauty's in the eye of the beholder, I suppose. But she goes, and goes well with that little big spurner, doing everything she should. Nice bit of steam coming out of there. Okay. Thank you, little lad.